Welcome to MechaWind. Here is a quick overview of how to use MechaWind. Across the top are the File, Analysis, and Help menus. The File menu contains the normal options of opening and saving a file. Options provided to enter company and project information that are displayed in the calculation output. The Analysis menu performs an analysis. The Help menu contains many useful options. Check for Updates will check to see if there is a new version. This only works when a major version released, not minor versions. Revision history shows all changes that have been made in each version. License is where you can activate or deactivate the software. It also has a link to the portal where you can renew your license. Report a bug is a convenient way to notify Mecca of a problem and it automatically attaches your input file. TeamViewer contacts Mecca to allow us to view your screen and troubleshoot a problem. The Analysis menu performs an analysis. The toolbar contains some of the same file options which are in the File menu. There are also several options to change the 3D graphics on the screen. There is also a Wizard button which guides the user through the main inputs, good for new users. There are also summaries of the major selections, and you can change these selections. Units can be changed in the upper right corner. On the right are the graphics options. Down at the bottom is an option that you check if you want to include some graphics in the output report. The 3D image reflects the current inputs, and if there is a problem with the inputs, then no graphic is shown. On the left is where all of the inputs and selections are made. The inputs are grouped into tabs. Related entries are also grouped by using colors on the parameter field. To get help on any input, simply hover your mouse over the input and additional help will be provided. It is best to work from left to right on the tabs. Also work from top to bottom on the inputs. Some selections cause other inputs to either appear or disappear, and so working from top to bottom avoids unnecessary work. Some inputs launch other input windows, and the selected shows the current option chosen. There is a validation system that is always checking users' inputs, and when a problem is found, instant feedback is given. A red cell or control indicates an error which must be addressed before performing an analysis. Hover the mouse over the red triangle to get the feedback on the error. The Perform Analysis button will be red and there is a red triangle in the upper right corner. The tabs containing the errors is also red. When you click on the red tab, you will see additional red cells showing the problems. Hover over those red cells and get more detailed explanation indicating the problem. A yellow cell is used to indicate that a value doesn't look right, but it doesn't prevent the user from performing an analysis. The main wind force resisting MWFRS system has multiple methods and each method has certain criteria that must be met in order to use it. The MWFRS button shows all of the methods. The green option means you are meeting all of the criteria. 
the red options indicate that all of the criteria are not being met. Click a red option to see specifically which criteria are not being met. The same system applies to components and cladding, CNC methods. Green indicates a method can be selected. Red indicates that all criteria are not being met and the method cannot be utilized. Once you enter all of the inputs, select the appropriate MWFRS and CNC methods. Then you may perform analysis to generate the calculations. Down at the bottom is an option that you check if you want to include some graphics in the output report. The output can be navigated by scrolling or clicking the table of contents on the left side to take you to that section of the output. Any items in the table of contents that are checked will be printed and saved in the final output. Uncheck boxes to admit that section from the output. The output can be printed or saved to multiple formats, PDF, Word, rich text, or HTML. Thank you for watching. Please email support at mechaenterprises.com if you need anything.